All right, friends, I am in West Texas today. Hot, 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 hot out, but not too humid, which is nice. And we are gonna check out this place called the Hemingway. I assume it's a nod to Ernest Hemingway and see what they have for a cigar selection. Okay, so we're outside because I don't want to be vlogging around a bunch of people and disturbing them. Went for the Liga Pravada number nine. It's like it has like a barcode on there, or stock number, 5741. Uh, they don't have liquor here, it's a beer and wine only. And here we have beer, no, beer and coffee. So thank you. Uh, so there's a nice outdoor patio. There's the pack on there. There's my shallow cut. They got some weird fancy torch lightery thing. I don't know. I'm out here on retreat. I left my cutter and my lighter at the retreat house. So we'll see how it goes. It's a single flame. I know nothing about this Liga Bravada, so I've had the H99, this is just the number nine. little bit of pepper. Some dark notes. Let's try it with some coffee. Mm. It's tasty. Is this a Maduro? I have to look this up. Also got a local beer, it's called Mosaic. I think that's probably the name of the hop. So we'll spend some time with this and see what we think. All right, here we are in the first third. And um, fortunately, the rest of the cap came off. Construction's holding together. It's a little sloppy. Burn line looks nice. It is uh, Connecticut Broadleaf Oscuro. So dark wrapper. We call this a Maduro. Is that offensive? Can we call it a Maduro? Does it have to be Oscuro? Lots of earth and coffee, but it's very creamy and very smooth. It goes, re the beer is really good, but it's not the perfect match. The coffee is great with this. Retro Hail has a little bit of pepper. It's Nicaraguan tobacco, so it's very Nicaraguan. Nicely aged tobacco. Smoke is uh, medium. Uh, the strength is pretty low end of full strength. And um, the taste lingers just a little bit, kind of medium um, on, the, on the flavor. Still in the first third, but look at that ash, which is probably gonna drop any moment now, but very nice. I got to 
Place is starting to fill up for a Tuesday night. All right, here we are in the second third. I don't know if you can see or not. There's uh, all these little dots on the wrapper here. Flavor dots, I like to call them. I feel like the smoke has gotten a little thinner at this point and um, I mean I, I'm outside it's a little windy so the burn line is a little crazy but not too crazy a lot of flavor things going on right now predominantly a coffee cigar But there's a little bit of, you know, the Hershey Special Dark. So it's like a dark chocolate, but it's a little sweet. Pepper is kicking up a little bit here. Still the earth, a uh, little bit of wood. Correct me if I'm wrong, but the H99 also had quite a bit of coffee flavor going on. Very good. Wish I had some whiskey to go with this. Let me know if you have had this, if you're smoking it along with me. If you've been to the Hemingway in West Texas, Midland specifically, Right here we are approaching the final third, and um, I don't know, pretty good, lots of coffee. Spice is kicking up quite a bit. I'm going to give this a score. Should mention these come naked, right out of the box, no cellophane. Hmm. We're gonna give this a 9.1. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, share, all that business, comment. Most importantly, pray hope, don't worry. Watch till the end, I'm gonna walk through the Hemingway just one more time. We're gonna have to replace the air conditioner, we're gonna have to replace tons of shit. I, I still like Returning the house later in cutters. And they're all mad they lost to him. All right. See you guys back in Maine.